You can buy any Chanel up in the store if you wanna. All right. Neighbors, we're back with some more Danganronpa V3 Killing Harmony. Last episode, we just completed another trial. Man, they got rid of a thug, man. And the person who killed that thug was the biggest, the, was the, <laughs> was the thuggiest of thugs of them all. I, I never would expect. Well, I should have expected. I don't know what to think of that. I'm not gonna lie. But at all, it, 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 it. <sighs> some real niggas was lost today. Um, now you're probably wondering where the fuck we're at. Um, if you are, why aren't you not watching these in order? What's wrong with you? But it's cool. It's cool. It's whatever. Um, we finally figured out what was in Maki's room. Um, she is not the ultimate child caregiver. Uh, there is nothing children related in this goddamn room. Like, even if, like, what is this? What? Is she in the covenant? They need to let me click that. I also don't know what happened to Logic. I think he got, like, I don't know what this is. Pox? Alopecia? I don't know. I know he got fur all over, so. I'm not gonna bother. Alright, well, he's fucked. Let's, let's just talk to Kaido real quick. Yo! Yeah, I'll leave this to you again. Do a good job, alright? Okay. No, yeah, well, I don't mind, but. Hmm? You don't mind, but what? No. No, it's just that when we were talking about Maki, you look really pissed. Ah. Oh, yeah, nigga, I can't believe she's an assassin. Well, that's... You know, I can't believe this shit either. She, she doesn't seem like she could be some terrifying assassin. You don't? <laughs> <laughs> terrifying, huh? Don't worry about either way, leave Maki to me. I'll take down that mask of hers. Be careful, man. People was trying to take down Dreams Mask, and look how that went out. Everybody hated that shit. All right, weapon shelf. Can I click it? There are a lot of different weapons here. Maki knows how to handle all of these. Up here, is that target? Uh. What? Ain't giving me shit to look at. Do I just leave? Uh, I guess I'm out of here then. Oh shit, I forgot to switch the game. You're right, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. Let me do that real quick. I wonder if that is a thing like mods could do. Not that it matters. My responsibility. How niggas know what I'm about to play. Alright. Alright, let's see. Wait, so we can get out of here? So where we go next? Is there something I'm missing? Oh, the keys. Okay, I forgot. It's the end of the trial, so we got. Here we go, bro. What do you want? Yay! If a new area opens up, that means more fun for everyone. Atua and I will cooperate so everyone can have a super fun school life. Atua is watching Atua over. Atua sees everything, even what everyone truly desires. Huh? What everyone truly desires? Maybe. On God, I mean on Atua. Atua is always watching over to me. How divine! <laughs> That's Atua for ya. He's so divine. Some bitch ass. I feel Angie is getting more and more creepy. Alright, so we got new items now that we completed the trial, so we're gonna see what things lead to. But this isn't a. That one was a pretty obvious one. What does Gonta gotta say though? Um, Nothing? My fault. Gonta was oh. wrong. Oh, sorry. Gonta think he see bug. Uh, um, yeah, you said that before. Is it a bug you can barely see? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Gonta feel like he can see it sometimes, but Gonta can barely see it. It's probably a mistake. Gonta. Cause Gonta wished there were bugs here, so Gonta just mistake dust for them. Is that really the case? Would Gonta make that mistake more than once? Allow Gonta. Anyway, if you find dangerous area, come get Gonta. Gonta will protect you. Sure, good looks. I know he means well, but I'm hesitant to ask him to be a shield. Maybe it's some in his glasses, man. Who knows? I'm still trying to figure out this contact shit. It's pissing me off, cause like I look like oh my god, I look sexy with contacts, right? But. I'm not gonna lie, if you, if you like easily put on contacts, you might be like, you might be one of LeBron's disciples, I'm not gonna lie to you, you're a demon, because that shit is, how are niggas doing that? Like, it's a two-man job every single time to put on fucking contacts, I can't do it. I can take them off, though, I'm not gonna lie, I, I can take them off now, but putting them shits on? Nope, <laughs> mom, can I have some help? I don't even know why I talk to you, but uh, too much is happening all at once, it's just too much for me. We almost case was a shock, but then to find out Kurumi ran the country and Maki's an assassin? Fuck, an average citizen like me can't keep up. I'm not sure the ultimate cosplayer can be considered average. But I'm glad I'm an average citizen. If I ever had a reason to live as strong as Kurumi's, or if I ever lost everything important to me like Ryoma did, if anything like that happened, I probably would have just cowered in a corner somewhere. Putting aside whether, uh, whether what Kurumi or Ryoma did was right or wrong, 
I think it's amazing they were even able to do anything at all. For people like them to die in this place, it's just not fair. You know, I might go get uh, oxtails tomorrow. I don't know where though, because I don't really even know where you get them at, but. Alright, let's use a magic key. The thing is, I gotta be able to afford it though. I'm kinda poor and you know, oxtails. Damn, that shit broke. And PM was good, bro. That sub alone just saved. There we go. Now I can buy the oxtail. Let's get. Let's fucking go. Let's go. The door collapsed. It looks uh, like we can get to the back now. What I wonder is beyond there. Perhaps someone awaits us. Huh? You think? <laughs> Merely a jest. Yes, this world is full of jests. Bitch ass nigga. All right. Let's see what's in here. Is it the gamer work? Oh, it's another floor. I wonder what the upper floors are like. There's nothing dangerous, right? Or is there? It's okay. Don't worry. Gonto will protect you no matter Thank what. Thank you. Thanks, Gonta. That's reassuring. A tuxedo and a mask would suit you. Um, Ooh, that's a bar. Well. I think she was going smack though, and I think he just I think she missed. Five dollar oxo? Nah, but I I was like five dollars short. Like I was I didn't really want to buy anything, cause like uh. What the hell? The frightening atmosphere was so oppressive. I let out a shout after without uh, realizing it. Um, what is going on in here? Okay, though, that one didn't scare me this time. Actually, um, so this is a made up story, but a brutal murder supposedly took place here. Why'd you tell me that? It's a made up story, but you're telling stop me. Stop it! Please stop! If I hear any scary stories, I won't be able to go to the bathroom alone. Um, uh, but she can, but she can, but she's saying made up story, so that means it okay, right? So long, farewell! <laughs> You mean she was not trying to smack a Gonta? I mean, I don't know. I mean, he looked like a son, and who isn't trying to go smack at a son nowadays? Like, well, I don't know what it's like nowadays. I haven't heard from a son in a minute, but. Bro, I'm not walking through this. Y'all see this? All right. Um, what's this? An ultimate lab. You should look inside. Maybe it's the, um, the, um, the gyne uh, gynecologist lab or whatever it is. Kyo shit. It's almost like a museum, a library. It's huge and a little eerie. They're very, ooh, ooh. You hear this shit? Some of them seem very rare. <laughs> it would appear this is my lab. The ultimate Bing Boing's lab. Wonderful. It's so wonderful. My face contorts with glee. Not even the university labs are so well stocked. But who brought all this stuff here? I suppose there's no point thinking about it. Nothing in this place makes sense. This area is Strictly reminds me of like Demon Slayer right now. Is that a really geeky thing to say? Some nerd shit? Oh no, I don't watch anime, man. Back door. I'll investigate around here a little more. Oh, I guess this leaves this is the room or some shit. This is this is Fi. Not even university like nigga, you already said this, bro. Alright, uh, let me open the this shit so we can look at. Bookshelf. It's packed with books and scrolls. They're all weathered That's and old. True. I don't think I could read all of these if I had a million years. Now, if they were all dire wimpy kid books, that'd be a different story. There's something in this case. It's a golden katana. How beautiful. It's rusted in places, but looks about a yard long. It's still sharp. Is that real gold? It's probably valuable. <laughs> you were drawn to that katana, I see. However, it is merely coated with gold leaf. Hmm. Ah, so it's not made of gold. Well. That said, that katana also was edible, like them little golden uh, steaks you see on YouTube in certain uh, rural areas. Katanas used to defeat uh, generals in wars or worshipped as gods. That is one such katana. It is an extremely precious relic necessary to spread. <laughs> oh, that's a super red katana. I want to take. I want to take a look. See, here this nigga go, man. Cox only uh, popped up between us and grabbed the katana from the case. <laughs> oh, wait, you mustn't touch it. Okay. What the don't worry, man. I'll be super careful with it. But I lie to you. Kyle completely ignored Kyo's warning and unsheathed his sword. Mm. Now, this katana is a real deal. It's even gold plated for that authentic look. Yeah. Mm, I see. It could also be used as a murder weapon. Hold on. Cock, that is an extremely precious relic. Please do not treat it so lightly or. I'll tear out your nerves. Or he'll do that. Please don't. Okay, I uh, get it. Please don't make such scary threats. <laughs> Damn, tear out your nerves? This nigga's thinking in Mortal Kombat. Cox slid the uh, sword back into its sheath and handed it to Ki back Whoa. to Kyo. Yeah, my hands are all sticky. That gold plating flakes off so easily. Uh, but I guess that's what makes it an authentic katana. Oh dear. Yes, it is very old, so the gold leaf comes off easily. 
In any event, please do not touch things without permission, you bitch ass nigga. These are all precious relics. So cool. okay, okay. Appreciate you following, Mars. In any event, please do not. Fuck. Oh, damn, if you do so cares. again, I swear to God, you'll die. I swear to God, you'll die. Please don't. All right, nigga, I get it. The scary threats really aren't necessary. And that's what Kyo sound like when he gets angry. Oh, I got to do a different voice. Noted. Um, I might get a katana one day. I don't know what kind. There was one that um, there was actually one that nigga from Demon Slayer. I forgot his name though. The the boar nigga. That should look fire. Like if I can find like a like a life size of that, that would be cool. There's a large wooden dog statue on a pedestal. It looks pretty old. I have a friend that had a katana, uh, and uh, in this in this house it looks sweet. It has uh, some kind of strange power to it. It makes me shiver just looking at it. Could it be? And Osuke, I think that, yeah, I think this is name. Incredible. Oh, can it be? I never could have dreamed that this truly existed. Kyo quivering with excitement, that nigga creaming. And slowly removed the white fabric on the pedestal. Uh, can this Yo! be? Yo! Uh, um, perfect for what? Uh, what what are you, what is the statue in cage for? <laughs> I never thought I'd be able to touch the real thing in all of my life. Damn, me seeing pussy for the first time. Today is a momentous day indeed. He's so focused that he's not even listening. Alright, what else we got? They gonna learn more about it? Oh, I didn't even see this exhibit case. There's a book in a display case. The bookcases were full of books, but I imagine this one is special. Mm. This one looks like it has it was bound by hand. Can it truly be? And this nigga <laughs> This nigga gonna have a blast right now. Unlike his usual quiet self, Kyo shouted and ran over to me with an alerted expression. With steady, careful hands, he took the book from his showcase. Incredible. It is! How amazing! It's actually real! Um What is that book, Kyo? Uh is an extreme can dude be? can he stop bursting in my ears please it is an extremely precious document do you understand this book is a history of the fabled cage dog village said to have been destroyed long ago the cage dog village yes the cage dog village had a reputation for using many dark arts as spells the village was destroyed at the hands of a federal lord who feared their power but one girl, the lone survivor, risked her life to write this book. Wonderful. Which means this is all her handwriting. This book is an extremely precious one-of-a-kind relic that has been soaked in her bitter grudge. Hmm. One-of-a-kind, that is valuable. I see, yes. On top of that, she since, this, uh, since this book has such a reputation, there are a few copies. Since I was fortunate enough to obtain one of these copies, I have already memorized it. Ugh. But I never thought I'd be able to lay eyes on the real one. What a trick of... Eat! Uck! Uck. Fuck. Boar nigger from Demon Slayer. <laughs> Thank you for that, Ness. Uh, um, but yeah, Nosuke. I look for a sword. I actually saw one of them joints where you can get like the small joints for a keychain. Because I have this habit of like spinning shit around with my hands. And I was thinking about getting one of those uh, little toy things where it's like small little swords you can spin around in your hands. I might get that instead. It's probably cheaper. So I can get off Etsy. Ah, Kyo, what did you mean by reputation? Yes. The rumor goes that the spell and dark arts inscribed in this book are extremely potent. Do I even However, care about this shit? They suppress the, comp uh, the comprehension of people who live in a world of science and technology. That is why it was buried in the darkness along with the entire cage dog village. <laughs> but it seems those were no mere rumors. I can feel power seeping out of this book. The deep-seated grudge of a girl whose village was destroyed permeates every letter. This is getting weird. I think I should just end the conversation. That's a good idea, because he's been getting new uh, sprites and animations ever since we entered this room. I'm not going to lie. I feel like the only thing I've learned uh, is that I've learned nothing about this lab. What? Listen. By the way, Sushi, would you like to lend your ear to the voices of the dead? <sighs> no huh? thanks, man. I'm good. Do you understand? The Cage Dog Village documents contain many dark arts unique to that village. Of all of them, the one I find most interesting is a se seance called the Caged Child. Yes. In fact, the wooden dog statue and iron cage over there are to be used in this very seance. <laughs> to discover it exists is surprising enough, but to actually have it before me. You see. So would you like to try? Let us converse with the dead uh, using the Caged Child, shall we? No. Yeah, I'm good, my nigga. I don't have any interest in the occult. Mm. Now, now, you mustn't dismiss it as simply the occult. Some matters are re you refer to as the occult are the utmost importance to anthropology. Dismissing things you don't understand as the occult is a defilement to all cultures, yes? 
Aren't you BLM? Aren't you BLM? No. I mean, yeah, but talking to the dead. Say. Haven't you ever wanted to speak with the dead? Huh? Huh? You can speak with the dead. If it were possible, I, I suppose I'd like to talk to her once more. No. No, no, no. I decline. Okay. Even if it were possible to speak with the dead, I don't have anything to say. Not yet. The only thing I'd want to say is we escaped. We finally got out of this bitch. <laughs> that determination is beautiful. Perhaps you are correct. Calling out on the dead out of Kieria. Forgive me. One must I call on them. Myself. Shut up! I felt a shiver up my spine. Alright, well, what is this? Door to the hallway. Okay, what about the back door, though? Hey. Boing, boing, boing. What is that? A, a sitar? Oh, it leads up to the hallway as well. Okay, where we out? What's next? What's down here? You see that red? Hell no, nah, bruh. Did I just pop up? Rise and shine? What did I just press? Oh. Alright, what is this? Oh, this is the lab again. Man, look at this shit. This is the door. Hanging scroll. I'm not gonna lie, this is fucking me up a little bit. Cause what, what am I looking at right now? Boo -doo, boo -boo. What is this? It's like a hanging scroll, but it's blank. Oh, it's like um, it's like from Kung Fu Panda. You gotta um, you gotta do something to see it, though. I forgot what it was. Look at this tie-dye ass door. It's a door to an ultimate lab. From the look of it, I'd say it's for art. Let's investigate a little. I grabbed the door knob and turned it. Hmm. It's locked. Oh damn. Oh boy. Yep. Seems like it. Guess we can't go in. Hmm. Why is it locked? The other ultimate labs weren't locked. Ah. Oh, by the way, this lab has some kind of rear entrance at the end of the hallway. I'm disappointed. But that was locked too. Uh, um. If both the doors are locked, how are we gonna get inside? <laughs> <laughs> Don't give up just yet, cause I have a secret technique. As if on cue, we heard the metallic click of a lock opening, and the door slowly opened. What? Yeah. Can I help you? Hmm. Why am I not surprised? Angie, you were in here? Hey, hey! I feel weird chatting out here, so let's all go inside already, okay? How pushy. Woohoo! Come in, come in, please come in, come, come! Ever polite, Angie invited us all into the lab anyway. There better not be no bullshit in here, Angie, I swear to God. I swear for God. Okay, a little stew. A little art stew. A lot less color than I thought. There are various art and carving tools. Makes sense for the ultimate lab, hmm. artist lab. Why does this lab have locks? Atua has spoken. He says this classroom was probably made for me. Huh? What does that mean? The fuck you mean? What is that? <sighs> Leave it to me. I will answer that with my sexy, beautiful voice. <clears throat> Wait a second. We said I was gonna answer that question. No, we didn't. Is, is your memory getting even worse, Montero? You promise, cause I don't remember you not promising. Stop it! That doesn't make any sense. I don't care. So what? Shut up. I'll click. I'll stick my hand up my butt, then shove it in your mouth and rattle your molars around. Ah! What? This nigga, this anal shit. Yeah. <laughs> what do you gotta say about this game? You said nothing. My fault. Ah! My fault. Well, Montero, we weren't fighting. Dude, we were just messing around, you know. I was—I I totally didn't say I was gonna shove my shit up her mouth. It's fine. You straight gangy. So? So what's up with the key? Actually. Ah yes, Angie's the kind of girl we who can't focus on her art unless she's alone. Maybe. I must shut out all the people and noises so that I can be one with the great Binga Bongunga. Yeah. <laughs> Atua is much too shy to be one with me in front of people. What about when you and fucking um Megamine was praying with each other? Wow, like a point. Wow, it's the opposite. So any room where I'm gonna make... Why did he say that? I'm surprised the monocups knew yeah. that. Hmm. And these are all my favorite art supplies and sculpting tools too. How did you know? Um, um what should I say? I'm, I'm not a good improviser. Calm down, I'm even worse. We know everything about you, bitch ass niggas. We are all because friends. we want to be your niggas. I don't like that. I want to be huh? your friends. Oh, my fault. <laughs> what's that? Who's that? Oh, what's good, Colin? I'm playing dangin'. I'm playing dangin' romper right now. I'm only interested in Monokuma. I mean, in logic. I don't want to get friendly with knockoff products. 
Nah, that's crazy. That was wild. I'm not gonna lie. I would be pissed off too. Why? <laughs> what the fuck, nigga? Why would you say that to me? But that's so rude. I won't forgive anyone who refuses to get along with me. Now, now, mandem, we we haven't given them the key to this room yet, have we? <laughs> yeah. Okay, here it is, but there's only one key, so don't lose it. Okay. It'd be bad if you lost it. You wouldn't be able to lock the door or open it from the outside. So then... Give me that shit. Mandem swiped the key from Manafani, then uh, lifted it to his mouth. Um, nom. What? <laughs> Nigga ate it. Ah. Oh, he swallowed it. <laughs> He's flatlining. Uh -oh. What are you doing? If you swallow that key, you definitely choke on it. Someone might use this key for murder because keys are mysterious. If something bad happens, it will be too late. Let's get along. I want everyone to get along. <sighs> oh man, you're so reckless. So... Let's carry Manim away for now. We'll carry him like a kind boss taking care of a drunk employee. So <laughs> what? You think they'd be the opposite? <laughs> Boss is not carrying out a drunk employee, so does that mean we can't get the key? The hell? Uh, but I'm only gonna lock this door when I'm inside working, so. No, don't even trip, bro. That's 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 Angie. You don't want to get cool with Angie. I don't care if I can't open or close the door from the outside. Actually, you know what, man? Do, do you, man? Do you, man? What am I? What am I doing, gatekeeping, being that old man? Uh, she right? a, she is she is smart, bro. <laughs> I guess that's fine then. By the way. By the way, those guys said they know everything about us, right? That's probably why this lab fits Angie's say so well. So does that mean this school was specially made for us? But I'm not remember. All right, Logic has claimed that before, uh, but is that really possible? This giant complex was built just for the 16 of us. Only Atua knows for sure. It's a miraculous mystery that only Atua knows, but it doesn't matter. As long as it's comfortable, I'm fine. Uh, yep. If our lives here become more enriched, then there's even less reason to leave this place. <laughs> I mean, just me off, cause she is bad, but like she's she's like she's like a piece of shit, you know? <laughs> That's true. Are we supposed to be okay with that? Are we supposed to look more into this or what's up? Doesn't look like we got a back door and a lump of wax. What is this heap of stuff? Doesn't look like wood or stone. Mm-hmm. Ooh, this is wax for making wax sculptures. Mm. Oh, wax sculptures, huh? You can make those, right, Angie? Yep, yep. Unlike wood or stone, wax has a soft texture for sculpting. Oh, but Atua is the one who's going to be doing the sculpting. Okay. Yeah, I, I see. But, but... But, but it, it seems like people have been making wax sculptures for a long time. In ancient times, death makes... Death masks used to be made from wax. Oh, oh wax like that, death mask. That's, that's kind of scary. That's her, that's her. I'm a voice actor, man. I gotta do my shit. Alright, can we get out of here? This door isn't the one we used to come in. Um, this door is super crappy. I, I'm guessing this is the rear entrance. See? See? It's got a sliding lock just slapped on there. If I remember Damn, this reminded me of a rain a little bit. Got a sliding lock on your door? I do. Interesting. Oh, right, and the door that we used. Yeah. Yeah, that door was a knob and a cylinder. Yeah, it had a knob on some shit. The same classroom has two different kinds of locks for the doors. That's mildly infuriating. No, no. No, no, it's perfect that they're not the same. Uh... Symmetry is a Western beauty ideal. They like symmetry and the golden ratio and all that bullshit. And then? But I think asymmetry and partition functions are more beautiful. <laughs> well, I'm trying uh, to crack. I don't really get, <laughs> I don't really get it. But I suppose that makes sense. I can't stay long. I still haven't found the flashback light. I have other places to check. All right, then we out. Let me crack a leg. Let me crack a leg. Let me crack a leg. All right, what else is in this this floor? Oh, that's the other door. Okay, keeping it moving. Nah, go back. That was the stew, bro. That was the stew. <laughs> it was cooking up in there. You ain't here. Yo, yo, this beat is crazy. It's all. It almost sounds like a um. <laughs> I keep forgetting this name. <laughs> Stop playing, bro. <laughs> She deaf for GD. All right. Yeah. <laughs> All right, dude. No, who was that? Here we go, bro. Nah, nah, not that. They was just posted up OD. Yeah, this my boy Gon and Shuigi. He look mad dangerous. Nah, he cool though. He he the friendliest um, out of us. This area feels so spooky. Gonta scared too. 
it's okay, the mon uh, the murder story was just made up. Not just story, Ganta just have weird feeling. Maybe stain on that wall over there is bl blood. No. It's just a stain, it's probably just staged, you know? Huh? Staged? Uh -huh. Logic or the mana cubs probably just put it there to scare us. Huh? R really? So the script has been flipped, huh? Uh, um. Shimuiji does this kind of stuff, uh, Shimuiji, does this kind of stuff bother you? Uh... Well, it's not that I'm okay with it. It's just when it's so overdone like that, it makes it seem fake, so I feel okay. Actually. But Ganta, you were so reliable until just now. I guess it's too early for you to wear a tuxedo and mask, <gasps> bitch ass nigga. Oh, oh, oh no, but tuxedo's essential for gentlemen. I Damn. Just bro, Matt Brawlick, I'm not trying him, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Look at this shit. Oh, That's it's a bomb. Oh, it's not even a door. They done Looney Tunes me. Oh well. Yo. I guess we out then. Sailor Moon you reference? Uh, damn it. <laughs> you black nigga. <laughs> is that like a um? Is that like a girly anime? The only girly anime I remember watching is like um, Peach Girl and um, what's it called? Uh, what is that shit called? Future Diary. Watching nigga yeah, I watch that black shit. Like um, my ordinary life. No, that's the greatest anime ever made. My ordinary life, Nietzsche Joe. Get this nigga out of here. I don't need to see him. He's he's gone. We lost the thug. Yo, Colin, I don't think you were there, bro. You remember little nigga, uh, uh, Hasbula? Yeah. They done got rid of bro, bro. They killed him. Not he gonna was, lie. He was my favorite. Yep. The the last trial I just did. The last chapter. He was the he was the victim. And the maid killed his ass. Yo, the maid with what? How 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 they do it? He uh he drowned him uh using the sink, but he hit it because it was like a magic trick. They were doing we were doing a magic show. Nah, he was the number one thug though. Like we need another gangster like him to slide again. Literally, he got out thugged, bro. I couldn't believe it. He got out thugged by a maid, bro. <laughs> me personally, I'm seeing that coming up. Like you're not getting me like that. What is this? They, li they lined them up oh, crazy. This no. is different. Yeah, that's just Sorry to up. hear it, bro. That's my favorite voice to do, and I can even do it. All right, what is this other bullshit I got? Is that a mallet and a scroll? I don't know, bro. Future Diaries for girls? I don't know. It seemed like something like the shorties love. I mean, I don't think it was only for girls, but. It wasn't bad. It was fine. I didn't finish it though. I didn't finish any show yet except for um Nichi Joe and I'm caught up with some shows. Like Spy Family and uh JJK. Oh no I'm not. I gotta watch the new episode actually. Damn, can someone cheat for me? Where where am I supposed to go? Go left. Let me go back up these steps. Maybe there's some I miss. Literally go left, trust me. Left. Shit. <laughs> Alright, this is... Okay, this is the tennis shit. Alright, now go left. Okay. Alright. Alright. Go left. Go left. Go left. <laughs> this is where we're at in the fucking beginning. Because I just opened this door, so it's not there. Go left. Damn, I just... Oh, I'm leveling up though all this walking. Hold on, maybe I can use the map. I just finished Spike Family? Bro, that show is great, bro. Oh, Buddy Daddies. It was like another show that's just like, that's kind of like Spike Family. Called Buddy Daddies. I don't think they're doing another season of that shit, though. So I finished that shit. That was a cool watch. Look at these niggas. We're empty room. Oh, there's some shit I didn't that, see. Uh, is that, is that bro, legit? And yeah. Other, other lady? Oh my goodness. Oh, I didn't even see this. Okay, right room. No, left room, bro. Oh, uh, you right. Oh, hell no. Nah. what I tell you, bro? See, you're gonna line up. Oh, I'm done. Candles just barely lit light a dim, dusty room. That's a ninja, bro. This is creepy. Hard to see, too. It seems like something. Golly. It seems like something that would appear in an occult manga. It's a tragic feeling here. It really does feel like something is going to pop out at you. Food, bro. <laughs> All right. Well, shit, what the fuck? They want me to click. Nothing. Oh, the light. 
Candles on the walls are the only light in the room. There are no windows here. It get pitch black if light candles go out. Ah, uh, please don't put them out. I don't really like the dark. I can't imagine many people do. Oh shit, now do I get out of here then? I don't want to be here dumb. no more. Nothing here. What's this room for anyway? Who knows, but I just saw um more investigating. Now, let me talk to Smooigi then. Um Even though I said all that, it seems like something is gonna jump out after all. This feels like one of those old abandoned asylums full of lunatics or criminals. To the point that I'd half expect to see a corpse burst through a wall and chase us. Sorry, that's not something to joke about. Nigga. Get me out of here. More? Look at the other light? Candles on the walls are the only light in the room. What? Oh, the floor. These floorboards feel a bit unstable. Oh! Oh, this floorboard got no nails in it. Huh? Oh, really? Mm. Yeah, floorboard just resting on top of cross piece. That's true. I suppose it's not just my but. imagination. But each floorboard is thick and they got no gaps between them, so it look okay. Got to not worry about falling through floor all of a sudden. But, but it's pretty dark here. It's, it's a little hard to see where we're stepping. Uh -huh. And in the corner, there's a hole in the floor, so it might not be good to go over there. There doesn't seem to be anything else of interest in this room. Mm. Doesn't look like there's anything important here, just an empty room. Oh! Oh! This is not an only empty room. You see three same looking doors in hall, right? All those rooms empty, just like this one, and they only got candles for light too. Mm. Ah, so there are three of them. Mm. Anyway, we no gotta worry. No reason we ever need to use empty room like this. You're right. True. Um. Then, can we leave soon? The darkness and the shaky floor are making me nervous. There are no windows, though. I forgot what the other shit said. I accidentally skipped it somehow. I don't have any reason to waste time in an empty room. We out, then. Say goodbye. Hey, hey, hey. Hope y'all doing all right right now. Hope y'all enjoying your souls. Y'all relax. Just so y'all know, we about... We about, like, 40 away from a 1,000 followers. Man, tell your aunties, man, to drop a follow, man. Make an account and follow me. So I guess you don't need to work on it. Let's look at the left room right quick. <gasps> His dead ass. Alright, nothing in here. Let me see what the center room says. What's the center room gonna have? It's only two of them that were gone. Let us see, let us see. Oh, just logic himself. Oh, I don't give a fuck then. They know, they know, they know, they know, they know, they know, they know. All right, so we don't got nothing else to do up here. We have something to look at in the courtyard, it looks like. Oh, I won't really teleport. Fuck. Well, I guess we gotta walk outside. Watch out. <clears throat> I forgot what was out there for me to fuck with though but I guess I will I'll just get over there and see what they said no damn why'd I be streaming though I'm hungry as hell hey hey huh what what huh what okay huh what huh what okay huh what huh damn I hate this filler portion of the gameplay And I don't even know how to get out of here. Like, I think it's this way. I wonder if because the niggas are dead up there, we're gonna let us go into the the rooms. You know what I'm saying? The um, you know, dead people's research labs. I mean, it, I'm sure it wouldn't matter since they wouldn't be there, and we don't got none, no use out of it. Let me go to the school store real quick. Never mind. Sorry, I asked. Damn, I'm misclicking all types of shit. Hey. <laughs> hey. Okay, what? Hey, can I go to this yet? Nope. Still nothing. The 
fucking gym? Yo, I have no sense of direction, my nigga. Jesus. Bing, 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 boy. Bing, bing, boy. Let's go through the other side of the area then. Like so. I bet. There are fewer plants than before. Maintenance must be progressing well. I knew it. It's becoming more and more beautiful, just like m me. Hmm. Here we go. Uh, really? Huh. Oh, you just made Amiko angry. Someone like you wouldn't know this, but this is Amiko when she's mad. No. No, I was just blushing. <laughs> huh? Whoa, what? From your own compliment? But... Miko, your expression doesn't change much, so it's hard to tell what you're feeling. What a pain. Changing expressions is a pain. That's the only reason you don't do it? Man, that emotion shit. Lay me where they going? Tanko wanna fuck the shit out of Megami, and I don't understand why. She's a little strange. I don't know. Yeah. There's something about her we don't know about. What are you doing, dude? What is that? What is that about to, what is that about to be? Oh, whatever. Uh, casino area. Oh, I already been through here. We don't need to worry about. Oh, can I go to the love room? Hold on, I need to go to the love hotel. Fuck. I guess not. This is the pool. What's down here? Damn, I'm fast. Y'all see me zooming? Backyard. She a Shaboyan expert at this point on oh, God, but she clit riding. Clit rubbing on some shit. Uh, this is where the lab is though, right? Go oh, on the dining hall. There's gotta be more to it than just that though. Oh, backyard again. What is a backyard? Oh, is that where that um tunnel was? I think that's where that was. So where do you want me to go? They're trolling me. The game's trolling me again. Maybe it's somewhere down here. Oh, maybe it's something I give to that little shit. The, the statue. Like these. We locked in like these. Ninja scroll, golden hammer. Probably this. Oh, we go through his mouth. What the hell? I think that's a bit much. What is this? A store? Huh? A building? What kind of technology makes a building suddenly appear? Wow! Hiya! It's not just any building, it's a dojo, so it doesn't matter how it appeared. Right! Like, I wouldn't care if a chef came by car or train, as long as they made a as long as they made good food. Is that really the same? All right, well, I guess this is where she's gonna be for a minute. It must be an ultimate research lab from the look of the building. It's the ultimate Kaido Masters lab, I'm sure of it. Well. All right, let's go inside. Don't be shy, Amiko, ladies first. What a pain. Yeah. Fuck you, bitch. Pushing Amiko along, Tenko stepped inside the building. That's true. That's a pleasure to check inside too. Yeah, they finna fuck in here. Whoa, this is a huge dojo. The Tatami mats are new. They smell nice. The what mats? Right, what we got? Giant wooden doll. That shit tough. What is this? It's a large doll made of wood. Oh, wait. Is it a doll? Is it supposed to watch over us and protect us? Just been a scaffold? Oh, I never changed. Is this from some kind of jump training? It's like a kung fu movie. Yeah, they really are. They, they want to be Kung Fu Panda so goddamn bad. You know Kung Fu Panda actually invented the art form Kung Fu? It was originally like a, um, it was originally a folk tale, turned into a manga, turned to real life, and then they made the, the little panda adaptation so that Jack Black has something to do that day. Uh, let's talk to Tenko. Damn it! See, this is my lab, you jerk! Why? Oh, are you angry? Why are you calling me a jerk for? Yeah. I'm so happy, I just can't contain my emotions like an excited dog that just peace everywhere. An emotional roller coaster, the complete opposite of Amiko. That's amazing! 
Now, this is such a nice dojo. I'm sure sparring will be incredible right. here. But without a sparring partner. Damn! Uh, yeah. Are we dead ass? Yeah. What? what the what fuck was, was that? that for? I finna. Uh. You kidding me, nigga? Why are you throwing me? Listen up! Mio Akaido is a super serious martial art. Instead of training, we just fight head on. Now, Himiko, aim for the heart. Huh? What? You're gonna start with that? <laughs> JK, JK. Wait! This is just kidding? Why do we go straight to actual fighting? Got it! You don't have a lot of confidence in yourself, do you, Shuichi? Bitch! Huh? <sighs> Let me calm down. Let me chill out. Let me chill out. You know what I'm saying? This is a, this a, one, this a lovely young lady here. You know, I'm not gonna do nothing to her. <laughs> I'm not gonna do a thing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You lack self esteem, and because of that, you are a bitch ass nigga. You seem more confident than before, but I can tell you still question yourself. Is she looking to my soul right now? She's talking. She's not even talking to sushi anymore. She's talking to tables and it's pissing me the hell off. That's what? why I'm mad. Well, I'm right, aren't I? I can tell when my sparring partner is burdened by doubt. Uh, okay. You might be right. Listen up. You know what works real good at lifting all that doubt? Neo Akaido. Because Akaido itself is a Japanese martial art that treasures a pure heart above all doubts. Emiko. So how about you, Emiko? Mm -hmm. Yeah. If we combine your magic with my Neo Kaido, then we'd be able to solve things by force. By force? I thought this was about being pure of heart. Yeah, I'm good. It's too much of a date. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus, bro, you don't, you don't give a fuck. Mm -hmm. This lazy ass scream. I see. Seems you are still too shy to show your emotions, Himiko. What a waste. You have the richest heart of all. That's right. You should do Neo Akaido and Miko. Training your body will help you express your emotions. Now, come sweat with me. And afterward, we'll hit the showers together. See, this is the shit I'm talking. All right, bro. My back, my neck, my pussy, and my crack. I feel like turning you into a gross frog with my magic right now. Oh, you're angry. I can see it in your heart. Uh, okay. Even I can see that shit. Yeah, get me out of here, dude. I just got my ass whooped. For fun. Literally for fun. Alright, what's the last spot, huh? What's that over there? <laughs> Come on, what's the big deal? I can't hold back any longer. But how? No, it's too soon. I'm not ready for... Man, what is this big brother so ass? Good. I won't make things work. Yo! Just the tip is fine. We can take... What is happening right now? Like, can I can I get a second to breathe, please? Them niggas e dating. <laughs> we could take this relationship to the next level, please. <laughs> but we, we shouldn't. Come with me, nigga. You better go full force, man. I don't care if you don't care. Never mind. It'd be fine. Just come with me. I, we'll do it together. Oh hell no! I gotta see this firsthand. Cut tables uh, in the building. Cut uh, tables. I'm gonna get <laughs> I'm gonna get cut yet again. What was that? I feel like I just saw something I wasn't supposed to see. I should check to see what's going on, just in case. Apollo lyrics? <laughs> oh, yeah. Please! I'm right? That nigga will be fiending right now. I can't wait to see what he what he said about that. Oh man. That nigga's been cut before I have. Did she go in here? This should happen to me last year. Late last year. Careful not to make a sound. I opened the door and peeked inside. I heard a strange sound. When I looked for the source of the sound, my eyes were met with an unbelievable sight. Let's fucking go. Man, you're really plugged up. You're practically throbbing. Yo. Throbbing with dust and debris, that is. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Can my soundboard work, please, out of all days? It's cool. Mm -mm. This is no good. No good at all. You must feel so pent up. It's, it's bad, man. It's terrible out here, bro. I now apologize. I've been neglecting my needs ever since I got here. <laughs> I bet you have, nigga. Debo. I'll get it all out. Trust me. I but feel much better afterward. Now, um, Twitch and YouTube. Never mind. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. My oh, channel's gone. Oh, um, thing. Oh yeah, your chassis is firm. Really firm. Your chassis. Like, your body is seriously incredible. 
I've never seen one like this. She about to take this nigga's soul for parts, bro. Be careful, be gentle. Victor, this is amazing. <laughs> be gentle. Whoever Hell put no, you nigga. together definitely knew what they were doing. Oh, I feel all tingly. Yo, can we get out of this, please? You definitely know what you're doing too. If you keep this yeah. up, I <laughs> just might. Yo, nigga, no way, no way. Oh! I'm about to be boy. Me bar bar boo me bitty bar bar. That's the sound you make when I touch that spot. Yo, get this out of my ears. I closed the door without a word. This was actually flashbacks. Like this is the worst day of my life. Me it was just doing some maintenance on uh, Debo's body. That's all it was. Indeed, nothing but that. Yo, you want to see what's going on too, Mono, uh, Mono Kid? My fault. I'll let you work. I'll let you work. All right. We got one more tool. One more mouse tool. I do not know where to use that shit. Let me see. This is sound like the aftermath of someone that didn't, who didn't pray today. <laughs> yeah, them niggas, were, them niggas were not praying. I got to talk to them again? What I got to do over there? Well, look. Let me focus on one thing at a time. What the heck? Oh, this is about to piss me off. A golden hammer. What would a golden hammer be for? And now my dad calling me. Give me a second, y'all. Why'd I meet that? Sorry about that, I'm back. None in there. I was doing a little bit of bullshit and I had to just... What the heck? New heat? What y'all talking about? Are you drawing? What were you drawing? Never mind. Do I want to know what you were drawing? Do I want to know what you drew? Bro, if it's not that me you scene, but I'm a uh, Debo instead, I don't want to see it. I'm not gonna lie to you. <laughs> I don't want to see it. I'm not gonna lie to you. Uh, I haven't been on this side. I don't think. Okay, this is a classroom. Nothing down there. What the fuck? Oh my lord, it's about to piss me off. This is an entrance on some shit. Ah, let me see. Mm -mm -mm. They wouldn't let me go into that love hotel yet. I looked all outside, so I guess they want me to go upstairs again. Was there anything on the second floor? Golden hammer. Oh, it's nothing, nothing. Mate. Oh, that's a door. I don't know what to say. What the fuck was that silver shit? Still can't hear her screaming defiance. Perhaps running isn't so bad. Perhaps we weren't strong enough to face it in order to live. Shut the fuck up. Yeah, I was already here. Ain't nothing up here, bro. Fuck. All right, let me go up, up, up the steps again. But yeah, that's what I gotta do, though. I was supposed to find the... That's, oh, I'm gonna look for a chest. That's what the next thing is gonna lead to. 
So I guess I need to just find like a bullshit wall or something. I'm not gonna cap, I'm about to look it up. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> I'm about to Google this. I don't got the patience. But before I do that, let me talk to the the radios real fast. Cause I guess they need to be spoken to again. What? Uh. Hey! What, what are you doing here? I forgot what happened to him. Logic stared at me in silence and disappeared down the hallway. Uh, I suppose um, he wants me to follow him? What could be down there? That nigga, man, he molding. Oh, you gonna show me with this? What y'all little that want, bruh? Go in there? Talk to me, man. Logic is glancing back and forth at me in the picture on the wall. Uh, um. This picture? Huh. I see. It's not a canvas, it's a pane of glass. Mm. Perhaps. Maybe I should use that item I haven't used yet oh, on what? this. Oh, nigga, I was never gonna figure that shit out then. I held the hammer in my hand, faced the glass in front of me, and threw it as hard as I could. So I was supposed to come back. Damn! I'm not gonna lie, I wouldn't have tried to hit it that hard the first go around, but shit. He got it. I knew it. Just as I thought, there's a hidden passage passageway here. Nigga said good shit. I don't know what he's up to, but this did really help us out. The passageway looked different than a haunted house, more like a factory ship looked like something from Final Fantasy VII! Hmm. This is eerie in a different way. Alright, let's go in. Which, I don't know if I'm beating that game. That shit, <laughs> I'm far in that game already, but Jesus. I just did a poor job leveling myself up or something. Cause I am ass. Oh my god, the original Xbox, the X-Bone! It's a giant machine. I've never seen this before. Look at this. Alright. It's only three of them now, man. If you come this far, that means you solved the painting puzzle. Good shit, monkey. Huh? What monkey? It's just, it's just Suichi. That puzzle was too difficult for one person to solve. I'm sure they got along and solved it together. Well, let's just play along. We'll put ourselves in danger if we defy him. It's true what they said. Damn, they are actually scared of this nigga, bro. I am certain it is not possible. A-M-P- A-L-M, 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 A-L-M. Oh, yes, yeah, so we should explain this room. Um, so this is the computer room. Computer room? But this computer isn't just some ordinary computer. This computer you're looking at is super amazing. If I remember correctly, it's so amazing you can use it to create a new world. So we can play Minecraft? Okay. Anyway, dude. Yeah, new world. You can use this to create a new mm. world. Wait, are you supposed to tell him that? I've already forgotten the plan. Uh. Yeah, you totally said way too much. Sorry. Fuck, I knew it. I knew it. You're so forgetful, Mentaro. You gotta try to remember what you can uh, and can't say. Sorry. Why didn't you help him, Mono Fanny? No. Eh? Oh. <laughs> when you realized he was saying too much, you could have helped him, right? So why didn't you, you bitch ass nigga? We're that. friends, right? So why didn't you help him? Uh, 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 uh. Well, you see, nigga, you're done. You are done. You're done. I am too. You too, Montero. Friends share everything, even punishments. You both are getting your ass whipped. Oh, I muted myself in this corner. Yeah. What? Backfire. So long. Farewell. No bap. This machine can make a new world. What are they talking about? But I'm not good with computers. I don't think I'd understand it no matter how much I investigate. You're not good with computers? Oh, that shit don't even matter because we got the chest we need. Ah, a treasure chest. Open the chest eagerly and... I found one. A flashback light. With this, I can find out what this place is. Why we're here. But before that... Oh, I don't oh never mind. <laughs> Oh, you found the flashback light! Wow, you're pretty dependable despite that lame face of yours. I respect that. Okay. Yeah. All right. I'll get the others. You just bring that to the dining hall, Suichi. Okay. Nope. Oh, off I go. See ya. What? He chatted away, and I couldn't get a word in edgewise. And he left waving goodbye. But before that, I guess we're just gonna look around first, real quick. At the computer. 
There's a fat ass giant green computer in the middle of the room. This machine can make a new world? What could that mean? With how little I know about computers, I don't think I stand a chance. I guess I have no choice but to leave it by for leave it be for now. Uh, monitor for communicating with us. Uh we'll chat with us. There ain't nothing else here. Is it Okay. Check if I had the shit inside. With this, I can find this place why we're here. Um. What the hell? So do I leave? Oh, I do leave. Oh, okay. Oh, we're we gonna go to the dining hall or something. Maybe I wasn't paying attention because I'm very, 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 very black. Actually, I can check to see. Nope, wrong button. Dining hall, got you. Nope. You know what that means. Dining hall. Hey, okay, okay, okay. See what uh, memory we're gonna learn this time around. Really? Sushi, is it true that you found another flashback light? Okay. Yes, it's true. I see. Wait, so Cock wasn't lying? I'm stunned, startled, shocked. Thank goodness. See, I told you niggas I wasn't lying. Good thing too, because I don't want my pants on fire. Actually. I want to start talking about what we're going to do, but Kaido wasn't here yet. Oh. Maki's not here either. Oh. Uh, Maki's not coming. I didn't invite her. Huh? Huh? You didn't invite her? Hey, hey. Forget about that killer. That thug. Hey, Mew, D-Boy, did you guys see the computer room on the fourth floor? Huh? Computer room, you say? Go on. Hey. Yeah, there was a big computer on the fourth floor. Would you take a look later? You and Debo might know something about it, right? My apologies. I'm sorry, I'm not very computer savvy. What? Oh, is that so? That's unexpected. <laughs> I have been meaning to ask, but Debo, what is your talent exactly? Well... Well, I can do all sorts of things. Indeed. Now, yes, I'm pretty good at one-man comedy shows, if I do say so myself. Don't worry. Keyboy's existence is the only ultimate thing about him. Other than that, he's got no talent. Do not mock me! I just told your bitch ass I'm good at one-man comedy shows. Have you seen... Um, um, Bernie Mac? I don't really get it, but we just need to check on this computer room, right? <laughs> I'm not gonna come just for some computer. It's gonna take way more than that. Uh, um, uh, well, the monocubs did say it was amazing. No. Hey, thanks for waiting. Oh. Kaido and Maki. <laughs> this uses as buckets of bolts, man. Yeah, bro, that fucking gearhead, that that gear tugger. Huh? Maki, why, why is Maki with you? Of course. Well, this is about the flashback light, so everyone should be here, right? Huh? <laughs> but when you say everyone, do you truly need to include a professional killer? <sighs> here we go. Fuck you, bitch ass niggas. I'm leaving. Come on, man. Wait, hold on a sec. Kaido gripped Ma Maki's arm before she could leave. By the way. Kaido, didn't you say you wanted to take down her mask or whatever? Got it. Yeah, I'm gonna take down her mask as a murderer. Huh? What? Hey, so... I just can't believe a girl like her is capable of killing people in cold blood. Um... Um, is it true? Are you really the ultimate assassin, Maki? Have you killed anyone before? Okay. Yes. Really? But... Why you hide that... Isn't it obvious? It's so she could kill us all before we figured out her identity. That's wrong. You're wrong. It's because I knew you guys would react this way. Huh? What? Because. When people learn my ultimate talent, they get the same fear in their eyes that you all have. Eventually, that fear will turn into hate. And then, someone will try to kill me because they're afraid I'll kill them first. That's... That's not... What's the point? Whenever someone learns my real identity, they try to kill me. It happens every time. Always. Huh? Damn, always? Like, even before the killing game type shit? That's crazy. Mm. Damn. Angel cooked? Yeah, cooked from a distance, alright? I'll see you with Doodle Mania and the, the Luma Mania, alright? I'll be looking at, so looking in. 
Oh, poor, poor Maki. I feel so sorry for you. I think I'm about to cry. Oh, I see. Because of everything you've been through, human life has no value to you now. Is that it? Jeez. She's an assassin, not some murderous fiend. Even if she did kill someone, it doesn't mean she thinks it's okay to... <gasps> hey, can you let go of me now? Mm -hmm. No? Oh. I don't finally let go of her arm and, let Ma and Maki let out a sigh. It's okay. <sighs> I knew you wouldn't believe me. That's why I kept it a secret and tried to avoid you niggas as much as I could. Oh, but someone who doesn't know how to mind his business kept dragging me places. Huh? huh? Are you talking about me? Well... I think so, my nigga. However, I'll say this. I have no intention of killing any of you worthless, lame-ass niggas. Unless one of you tries to kill me first. <sighs> Having said that, you probably won't believe me anyway. Then... So you guys mind your business. I'll mind mine, and we'll all agree to avoid each other. Please, just pretend I'm not even here. Maki. Started out as a threat, but the last bit seemed a little sad. You're so dumb. Jeez, Kaido, what were you thinking? Are you trying to turn us against each other? I think I speak for everyone when I say we're all disappointed in you. Right, guys? Right? No, no I wouldn't say that, but... Tell me your thoughts. Shall we finally get started? We've all gathered here for the flashback light, yes? Everyone! Yes, so we all have all decided what we're going to do. Sneak attack! Use it, of course. We might be able to remember something new. Like the true purpose of the ultimate hunt. No. Well, we don't know for sure if it's got anything to do with why we're trapped what here. Was that? Don't give me that wishy-washy bullshit. Of course it's got something to do with wish. Hey. What? Hey, instead of arguing, it'd be way faster if you just use it, you know? Right. Yeah, got to worry, but we gotta do it. But, but... But, but no matter how we remember, you can't think about wanting to leave this place. Come on, come on! If you think like that, uh -oh. we'll just be repeating ourselves. You gotta be kidding me! You know, I know that. We can't go around repeating ourselves. We must do it. Then let's give it a try. Uh -huh. Sushi, go for it. Um, I'm a little nervous. I'm sort of just plain nauseous. Everyone turned their eyes to me and flicked on the flashback light. And at that moment, once again... The world warped. Jesus, bro, I have to go through this whole shit every time? Looks like. I don't even know. My consciousness went white. Somewhere in that whiteness. And somewhere in that whiteness, a scene played. Damn. Can it click? What's going on? Yo! You're so young and talented. How could this happen? What the... It looked like an accident. They were running away from that group. Oh yeah, from earlier. I remember seeing some like this. What the heck? Was it really just an accident though? Did we all die? I honestly can't believe that. Ah! What was that? A funeral? It was mine. It was everyone's here. Huh? Why was I at my own funeral? What? what? A funeral? You too, Sushi? I see. It would appear we all remembered the same thing. What the fuck's going on? But what the fuck does it mean? Why was I watching your guys' funeral? And why was I there too? Why? Here we fucking go, bruh. She don't even have... Did, does she even have an umbrella in the game? Hmm. But the only thing I can remember is seeing that funeral, nothing else. No way! But maybe we already dead. <laughs> no way. <laughs> Jesus, so stupid, I couldn't help but laugh. I mean, there's no way that was our memory of our funeral. Yeah. Nigga, then what was it? I mean... It was probably a memory of our school festival or something. What? School That's festival? Right. Yeah, it was probably a memory from a play we did from the school festival or something. I mean, isn't it obvious if you just think about it? Of course! If that funeral was real, there's no way we'd still be alive. Yeah, that's true. You're spinning. You're spinning. But aren't we all from different high schools? Why would we have school festival together? Well, that's that's well. We'll probably remember something else about it later. Got it. Anyway, there's no way that funeral was real. There's no mistake in that. Logical. You're right. If you think about it logically, that's clearly out of the question. Thank goodness. Okay, good. Got to think everyone is already dead. Don't worry about <laughs> it. Stop saying stupid stuff. Look at me. I'm alive. Hail and hearty. <laughs> hearty. <laughs> Could you get a hard on every time you see me? Ma'am, 
you're not you're not that guy all right oh, yeah. you're kinda but not all the way all right relax oh i heard males can tell they're healthy by how hard they get in the morning is that true is that true chat what hey stay in your lane bitch oh. damn I'm, I'm not good with other people's dirty jokes this is, yeah, this is my reaction to all this information i'm not gonna lie to you i'm disappointed oh man what a disappointment huh a disappointment why is this shit moving so slow? It's true. That this flashlight light was kind of a letdown. A little. Eh, they fell off. They fell off. We didn't find out anything about the ultimate hut. Just some weird memory. Okay. Yeah, seriously. Talk about a disappointment. Uh -uh. No, I'm not talking about the memory. I'm talking about you, bitches. Huh? huh? It's a lie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's nothing. I'm just lying again. So don't worry about it. <laughs> I wish you wouldn't have said anything in the fucking first place. But more importantly, the memory of the funeral we saw. It can't be a memory of a real funeral. We have to learn more about this. No matter how hard I think about it, I can't rub my head around it. After that experience, we ate at a meal in the dining hall and returned to our rooms. I'm struggling to read tonight. Golly. It's because I'm hungry. You actually did go crazy on this drawing. Oh my goodness. You win. You win. I feel like there's some kind of uh, secret about that funeral. I can't stop thinking about it. But it's hard to deduce anything from such a short scene. I could ask logic for a hint. That would help, but... Hmm. I shouldn't waste my time trying to solve an unsolvable problem. Still have some time left today. Maybe I'll head out and clear my mind. You better move. You better move. Free time moment. Whew. Damn. I'm actually really hungry. So I'm honestly going to cut this stream sh short. 12.30. I mean, I guess it's not short. It's been an hour and a half. Uh, thank y'all for pulling up. Appreciate Alwyn again for rating. I'm sure he's not here because he didn't want to watch um, anything and wrap up footage and get spoiled because he's playing two right now. But I appreciate him regardless. Yeah, man, streaming has been so fun, bro, because it's just like... I don't know. Just, you know, just having niggas around. Like, usually I just stream and I just do it for videos, so I don't really be paying attention to the chat. But now that I... You know, I just have like, like I feel like I'm running a show right now. It's cool. Like it's it's, it's kind of neat. I'm not gonna lie. I was kind of sad for a second. I was like, damn, if I do this, because I was gonna have a job at first. I thought it was gonna get in the way of me streaming. I ended up not doing that job, but I'm looking for something else right now. I'm actually got to do an interview for that tomorrow. So wish me luck, I guess. Um, but you know, we gotta. It's just been cool. And we're getting close to a thousand followers. Yes, once again, if y'all are still here from the stream, you haven't followed, please make sure you follow for me. Please, I really want to do this cool. I want to get this fucking stream idea over with so I can turn that into a video as well. And it'll be just so cool to see a, another thousand on my belt. Same with the main channel too. If you haven't subscribed, I highly recommend checking out that channel if you want to see more of me, especially me and my friends. We do, it's fun. I've been really liking the video of the main for the past while, for the past few for past minute and um so peep that if you haven't and um i think that's it i think that'll be all i share all i'll indulge in 